Well, we are here live on the floor at ATTD 2024 here in Florence, Italy, and I am very privileged to be here in the Omnipod booth uh, and I have a very special guest with me today, Trang Lai. Welcome to the show. And why don't you introduce yourself to the audience and tell us what you do here at Insulet. Yeah. Hi, everyone. I'm Trang Lai. I'm Senior Vice President and Medical Director here at Insulet, and I uh, run the clinical and medical programs. And we're super excited to be talking about Omnipod 5 at ATTD. Very cool. And, you know, for, for patients like me who aren't yeah. maybe as, as sure of what you know, a, senior, a senior medical advisor might, might do or what your role is needing like this, yeah. what can you share about the work that you're doing here in this room? Yeah. So one of my roles as medical director is really telling, sharing with doctors the clinical benefits of the technology that we bring to market so that they have the right knowledge and they can provide the best care for their patients. And so doctors love to know what's coming in the pipeline, what devices are connected to what sensors and how it can best you take care of glucose control for, for their patients. And with a product like Omnipod 5, it's more than the fact that it's just a tubeless pump. It's also, you know, what is the ability to customize the glucose control in an automated insulin delivery system that can take care of a young child with type 1 diabetes or an older adult with type 1 diabetes. You know, there's a difference in the approach that you would set up these systems. And so doctors love to know all that information and how to best care for their patients. So that's a really unique role that I have at Insulet is really sharing that information to doctors and also with patients as well. So we have a lot of people with type 1 diabetes attending this conference and really want to be on the cutting edge of all the technology. You mentioned something interesting about integrating the device with sensors. I know yeah. that's part of the big news for Insulet here at yeah. ATTD is that there are more sensors coming integrated with Omnipod 5. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, so Omnipod 5 was first came to the uh, US market in 2022, and we've actually only been in full market release for 18 months. And over that time, um, we now have a quarter of a million users on Omnipod 5, and that's with the G6 configuration. So we right now are um, in limited market release with the G7 configuration in the United States. And we also just announced that we'll be launching with the Freestyle Libre 2 Plus sensor in the Netherlands and UK in the first half of this year. So really super, super exciting because outside of the United States, and I, I think a lot of your followers are probably in the US, outside of the US, there are lots of different sensors on the market. And actually the Freestyle Libre Abbott sensor is really popular. There's five and a half million people. Uh, in the world who use the Freestyle Libre sensor. So being able to reach those patients and being able to provide better care through a, um, a patch pump that can deliver automated insulin delivery on body continuously, those are the benefits that we want to be bringing to um, many, many more users in the world. It's exciting. I think like more access for more people That's and more right. customizability and then yeah. being able to share the outcomes as well with the clinical teams, I'm yeah. sure is really impactful. One of the things that I really like about these professional industry conferences as a patient is that I get to see it kind of go around the floor and see what the future of diabetes technology and care is going to look like. Yeah. So when you think about uh, the future of diabetes care, what gets you excited about what is, is going to be coming to patients uh, yeah. from Insulet here in the next sure few years? Yeah, I. what I'm really excited about is the ability to connect to many more sensors and provide automated insulin delivery to many more patients in the world. And I'll, I'll share with you, I attended one of the sessions this morning and they talked about smart pens and, you know, being able to see when people dose and then, you know, the fact that you, that, that technology enables people to get better timing range if they can see when they dose and cause it's so easy when you're giving injections to like, d hang on, did I give that bolus right. or did I forget? Like there's nothing really telling you, right? Unless you have a connected system and you know, we take it even a step further with our patch pump in that within our pod itself, it has the algorithm where it wires, wirelessly takes that sensor value and then it dynamically adjusts that insulin delivery every five minutes on body so that you don't even have to think about 
whether or not you took that bolus or not, and how much insulin on board do you have before you're about to do something. So that's what I really love is like the fact that there are still so many people out there still using injections, the fact that we can deliver better care with, with our system. That's, that's what I'm super excited about. I want to throw a little curveball yeah. for you because I, I heard about this through my doctor, actually, yes. that in the U.S. on some commercial insurance plans, yeah. you can get a 30-day Omnipod prescription <laughs> when you go on vacation. And there's some, uh, so I don't know if you know anything about this. I apologize for, for throwing Nothing. this in. Yeah. But, you know, for people who are either on injections or on a tube pump and want a little bit of flexibility, yeah. uh, how, how is that part of the strategy for kind of meeting patients? With yeah, so... You we can do we can do trial periods with our system. So I think with Dash it's thirty days. I think with Omnipod Five it's a shorter period of time. I think it's only ten days. But the reason why we do this is because so many people out there actually don't know what Omnipod is, right? Like you know, because you've been covering this for a long time. Okay. But actually, there's so many people who don't know what that Omnipod even exists, and so they're they're giving injections because that's what they were told to do by their doctor. And so the part of it is awareness and building awareness, and which is why I just love the work that you do and, and, and so many diabetes influencers do, because it's really about bringing awareness of the technology to the general public and being able to reach those people who don't know about the technology, who don't get to go to conferences and see what the latest and greatest it is, because it's really the technology that is changing the way people take care of themselves. And, and so with our trials, um, what we found with Omnipod users is once you try it, you don't really want to go back to whatever you were using before. So it really gives people the freedom of not having to wear a tube palm, not having to give injections. It's really a, a marvelous product. And doing these trials is a way for us to get the technology to, to patients and often the the actual coverage for commercial payers is actually very high in the US. More than 90% of covered lives have access to Omnipod through the pharmacy channel. So what that means is there's not an enormous out-of-pocket cost to even start Omnipod. And, you know, with our product, if you don't like it, you don't have to continue using it, right? right. So we're so confident in our product that we can do these trial promotions. It's very cool, very innovative, and I love the flexibility for patients to say, you know, here's what I need right now, yeah. and I have the ability to, to make that happen. Because, you know, you, you live in Dallas, Texas. I it's do. a really hot place, it is. right? And you might want to use it in the summer months, and, you know, then you might want to take a break, and that's okay, because we're all about choice and giving people access to what they want to do to take the best care of their diabetes, so... You know, we, we think it's something that every person with diabetes should, should trial. Well, thank you so much for your time. Thanks, Rob. I really appreciate you joining us here at ATTD. We're looking forward to the next time we get to the link up. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, everyone.